Hi YouTube family, today I'm going to be bringing you what I call tools of the trade. These are items that I have that are basically skincare tools that if you are a skincare lover, you're a makeup lover, these might benefit you. And the reason is, is because we know that good skincare leads to pretty makeup. So I want to introduce you to these. Some of them aren't necessarily for the face, but they do help me a lot. So let's go ahead and get started so you can see what I'm talking about, tools of the trade. So this is my five times mag magnifying mirror and I just blinded you with it, I'm sorry about that. It has a suction cup right here on the bottom of it, which which is really nice because you can use it in the shower if you want to. I don't use mine in the shower. I use mine to pluck my eyebrows with because I can't see close up anymore. So I'm gonna turn it on so you guys can see. I don't wanna blind you, but it is definitely um, got the bright lights around it, the LED that need to kind of warm up a little bit. It is battery operated. So I will say that that is one thing that is a little bit of a drawback because you know batteries run down fairly quickly. I get the rechargeable ones, so it's a little better. But I don't do my makeup in this mirror, though, because five times magnifying, ten times magnifying, that's going to make me hate my makeup. <laughs> I actually had this conversation with one of you subscribers, is that if you use these big mirrors to put your makeup on, it's never going to look flawless. It wouldn't matter if you were 15 years old and had skin like a baby's bottom. It would not look good, but I love this one for the, you know, the specific things that I need to do. And there are times when you want to look at your skin up close to see how it's doing. Like right before you start Retin-A or right before you start a new serum, you want to see how your skin's doing. It's texture, it's pores, you know, the, the dark spots or whatever you have, if you have scarring, whatever. And then you can kind of go back and see the improvement on it later. It's one that I... I reach for all the time. So five times magnifying mirror with the LED lights, love it. And then the next one is actually not one that I use on my face, of course. You wouldn't use one of these for your face, but this is a, um, a bristled brush that you use in your hand that I actually use for my lymphatic system. And to try and help the body move the lymphatic system is what actually helps, you know, how you get the ripply fat look on your butt or on your thighs, That's I've got that. I'm trying to, as I lose, weight, you know, get rid of it. Fat holds a lot of toxins. So sometimes we need to really give it a little bit of a push. So I actually looked at a chart of how the lymphatic system flows through our body and I actually brush my skin with this a couple times a week. It really does help that blood flow come up to the surface of my skin and that's going to help you have glowing skin. You know, you'll have prettier legs, prettier arms, wherever you use it. And it does also help with cellulite. Now I'm not telling you that it's going to go make your cellulite go away because it's never made mine go away. But as I'm losing weight, I have noticed that I've really enjoyed having this. The next one I think I've shown this to you guys quite a bit before. This is my Panasonic wet dry razor. I use this, I don't use it in the shower, I use this when I don't feel like I can do my legs, shave my legs in the shower. Cause there are some days I am hurting so bad with my fibromyalgia, I just can't. So this one, does have a charger, so you don't have to worry about that. You don't have to have batteries for it. It also has a little flip up here that you can use as a trimmer for if you do the bikini area or whatever. So I do like it. It doesn't get as close as an actual razor does when you shave your legs, I will say that. And it does seem to come back quicker, but it's so much easier on me. Like when my back is flaring or my hips are flaring, it's so much easier for me to be able to sit down and do this out of the shower as opposed to using a razor in the shower. So I really, really like that. Okay, I'm gonna show you two different rollers. I'll get to the jade one in a second. This one is called a germanium roller, and these stones in here are germanium. But what I like this one for is it's so cooling. So this part of it swivels by itself, and this is the handle, and it's made of steel. Now, Nurse Jamie developed it, but I didn't buy mine from Nurse Jamie. I think hers is around $70, and I didn't pay that for this. I'll make sure that you know what I paid for it right up here. But this is so cooling, and those stones, as I use these to massage my jowls, I just have found that it's helping so much because I knew that I was gonna have loose skin as I started to lose the weight. And again, this is the lymphatic that you're moving. And sometimes when you have a headache or something, 
you need something to roll on that feels good and this tool can be really good for that okay. and i also use this jade roller for that specific reason too now the small end of the jade roller i use around the eyes and oh my gosh if you guys get a headache where your eyes are just hurting I love to use this thing. It feels so good. And the same thing for this side, you can use it just about anywhere. When my husband or my son gets headaches, one of these tools is gonna come out. But I use them all the time for my own skincare. This one, well, really either one of them. You can keep these in the refrigerator if you want to or the freezer if you want to. And if you have puffy eyes, that works so good to take that puff out of your eyes. So if you have a caffeine serum and these in the morning and you have, you know, really big bags, that will help. It really will. And that's what it was designed for is to really move this system of our face. We get so in tune to not touching our faces, right? It's okay to touch our face. It's okay to touch around our eyes. What's not okay is to pull. All right, we're going to talk about the feet for a second. This tool right here, I got at TJ Maxx, I think, and I really think I only paid like four or five dollars for it. I love this tool. It's a four in one tool. This is like a scraper or a really heavy duty file. This is your emery board right here. You have your bristled brush over here and then you have your pumice stone over here. I use this thing all the time, you guys. Every time I get out of the shower, every time I get out of the water, whatever I'm doing, I'm gonna be using this. I, I get so much skin, because as I'm noticing, as I'm going into menopause, my feet are starting to, around the heel, is starting to get so dry. What I'll do is I'll first use the scraper tool, and then if I need to on my toenails, I'll use the emery board, and then I'll use the pumice stone, and then I'll use the brush to get off anything loose. And I will use the brush in between the pumice stone and the scraper too, to get off any excess skin, and then you can go a little bit more, you know, go a little bit more deep with getting off that excess skin off the heel, but this is such a lifesaver, you guys. Four bucks, five bucks, you can't go wrong. And then these right here, you guys, these are from Tinkle. They're, they're the eyebrow razors originally. I use these all over my face for peach fuzz. And I know everybody's, you know, kind of a little leery about the whole shaving your face thing. But when you want your foundation to look smooth, when you don't want to have any, you know, I have stray hairs that I have to pluck all the time. When you're just so tired of that and you want to do one swipe, this is so good. I do have a tutorial where I use this so I will try to link that below and well I'll try to remember to link that below but I'll show you what it does and the peach fuzz that it gets off and it's so nice you guys I really I buy them in I think this comes in a four pack or a three pack or something so I just use them when I feel like you know it's gotten a little long or you know I need a little bit of you know smoother makeup I'm special occasion those kinds of things, but these are really good. And then next I wanna talk about trophy skin. Okay, this is the one and the next one I'm gonna show you that aren't really like super cost effective, but you guys, this is worth it to me. Trophy Skin developed this tool and I'm, I'm probably gonna say it wrong, but I think it's called La Belle. And it is a spatula and basically what it does, so hopefully you guys can hear that vibrate. I've got a fan on in here, I apologize. But what this does is it's got a lip on it. So this little part right here, let me turn it off. It's vibrating, you probably can't see nothing. Okay, so it's got a little lip that lifts up right here. When you guys are wanting to do an exfoliating treatment, you can spray your face like with any, like I love the Kopari um, coconut rose toner. I love this stuff. And what I'll do is I will spray my face with this, you know, doing a facial. This is be when you were doing like pampering night for yourself. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna spray your face with your favorite toner, with your favorite essence, whatever you wanna do. And then you're gonna take the spatula and you're gonna take the scraping end that, so you're gonna use it so it's angled down and you're gonna go along your skin and it's going to create a, an exfoliating experience. And you guys, this is so nice because if you have pores that are clogged, or if you have skin that is loose or whatever, and you don't wanna use a chemical and you don't wanna use a scrub, this will do it for you. This will just be so good for you. The other thing that you can do is you can actually turn it over and use the side that's kind of rounded and you can deliver your, your serums that way. So it's just pulsating a little bit into there. I love this tool. This is the most pampering tool and I just think it's great. So I don't know if this will show up on camera or not. If it doesn't, I'm not going to go ahead and even show it to you, but hopefully it will. Okay, we're gonna get close. So 
as I go along, excuse the hair, as I go along, what's gonna happen is this is going to exfoliate all that skin. But I wanna show you, look at all the gunk it just got off my arm. Look at that, isn't that crazy? It gets a lot of junk off of you. It really, truly does. And I love that about that stuff. It just makes me want to do it all the time. I only do it a few times a week, but it is really a nice little tool from Trophy Skin. And I think you can get it on QVC. That's how I got mine on Easy Pay. Okay, second to last tool is my roller, my derma roller. I love this thing, you guys. This will make little teeny microscopic holes in your skin. Now I want you to be careful and remember that not all rollers are created equal. And I do have a video about derma rollers because there are some derma rollers that aren't actual medical grade individual needles. They will be um, like too many of just like little puncture tools, which will actually rip your skin apart. And I want you to be very careful about getting a roller that has medical grade needles on it. Okay, enough said, you can watch the other video about that. Now I do use a numbing cream with this, a lidocaine numbing cream, you can buy it at Walmart, you can buy it um, off of Amazon, I'll make sure I list that with the other stuff, but I do use the numbing cream because the forehead, the forehead is the hardest part for me to muscle through. But the lips, you guys, it, I really do feel like all this time of doing it, it has plumped my lips. And what's really sad is that I've kind of slacked off these past six months with all the health stuff that's been going on. So I gotta get used to this all over again. But I don't feel like my lips have gone backwards, which I really like. So if you want your Retin-A to really, really work, you can use this. But it's also great to just use other serums like your niacinamide serum, your Buffet serum, um, any serums that have vitamin C in it. All those kind of serums, once you do this, once you make those microscopic pinholes from the needle, once you do that, this is gonna, your serums are gonna penetrate like no other, you guys. It's gonna be so, so deep into your skin, deeper than you could have ever done yourself. I actually do do it through my eyebrows though, and I really felt like it really has helped my eyes lift a little bit. It made such a difference when I first started it, and I, I did it so faithfully for a year and a half, almost two years. And I felt like it was just one of those that I would never stop and then things kind of get crazy in your life. You know how that is. Okay, so the last one. Now, this tool right here is really intriguing. This is called the Dolphin. And there is a YouTuber here that is called Jen Amber. But and she actually developed this really cool tool. And what it is, the Dolphin is shaped like our face is shaped and it doesn't have any sharp edges on it anywhere. It's very sleek. So it has this great steel on all of the ends of it. And the turn on switch is on this side. So you turn it on and then this little side turns blue or if you, or if you push the button again, that side will turn red. When it turns blue, let me, went right there. When it turns blue, what's gonna happen is you put your finger on there and it's going to vibrate. This little tool vibrating into your skin feels amazing but when you put it over here on the red it's going to heat it's going to get warm and that warmth is so wonderful i'm gonna put this down by my microphone i know you can't see it but hopefully you guys can hear that so um when you have your finger on here it's going to um, just give you a wonderful facial massage i can do this for an hour at a time. It will beep when it's time to like switch areas. It'll beep at you and as soon as you take your finger off, it stops, which is nice because what happens when it stops is it's not using the battery power anymore. But again, the blue, it doesn't have any heat. The red, it turns the heat on. It's not hot, it's just warm. Again, when I was talking about headaches and the pressure behind the eyes and all that, this baby does such a good job. Now. The design of it is so fantastic. So this design right here, this part right here, I can come up into my eyes right here and the curvature of my eyes. I can use that design down my nose and I can use it across my chin like this. You can use it on your cheekbones like that. Anything you want to. This point right here is really great for doing the lips. I love doing the lips with it. I love doing the eye with it. So shaped in such a great way that no matter, did you hear it beep? No matter what you're doing, you know, where you're using it, you're getting such a great massage and it's curving with your face, which is just the great part of it. It does have a port right here. It is rechargeable. 
I love that. I think it's fantastic. The LaBelle from Trophy Skin, that is rechargeable as well. This one was rechargeable. The shaver was rechargeable, just the mirror wasn't. I'm telling you guys, if you have headaches, if you want you know to rub your cream in take some time get some pulsating going get that blood circulating up to those eyes around those lips anywhere in your face that you feel like needs more collagen and it can stimulate because that's what it does the blood stimulating the collagen stimulating so it really is good and i use this also on my again on my neck and my lymphatic system you can use it anywhere you can use it anywhere, it just feels so good. It's not a really high vibration, it's actually quite a low vibration. It's just relaxing, it feels good. I would highly recommend this if it's something that you've been thinking about or haven't seen before. It's just a great little tool. And the heat in it is great too. All of these are designed to help you deliver your serums, your creams, everything in deeper into your skin and help it work better. So that's it for today's video. I hope that you did enjoy seeing my 10 gadgets that I absolutely love. Yes, I do use them all. No, I don't use them all all the time. My derma roller is something that I do like to work into my schedule on a regular basis. And also the spatula and the dolphin are things that I will either you know use on opposite nights too. And I always wanna pass on good skincare to you guys and things that can help our skincare even even more our bonus so I hope you guys are all having a great day hope everybody is really well take care of yourselves I'll see you all in my very next video love you much bye bye